This video is going to demonstrate how you can configure your project to create multiple outputs from a single source. Uh, so I've got a sample project opened here that contains a couple of conceptual topics, um, a .NET assembly that I'm generating documentation for automatically, and the default profile that's been created along with the new project. So this is currently configured to output a compiled help file, a CHM file for this project, and not to create browser web help um, output. Now although we can create both outputs from a single profile in document X, what I'm going to do is create a second profile for, specifically for the web output, uh, the web ready output. I'm going to change a couple of properties in there to illustrate how we can create those two outputs from a single project. So I'm going to start with um, start by creating a second profile and instead of creating a completely blank new profile I'm going to base this second one on the existing one. So I'm going to right click on it in the project explorer and select clone and that's going to create and open the second new profile for me. So I'm going to call this um, Web Help and I'm going to go back into the original profile here and I'm going to rename that to Compiled Help. And you can see here I've uh, renamed the title in the Compiled Help profile to indicate that it's Compiled Help. And I'm going to change that then in the Web Help output to indicate web help. So in the web help profile that I'm working in now I'm going to untick the option to compile a help file and I'm going to tick the option to create browser help output, so web ready output and switching back to the compiled help profile I'm going to make sure that's all correct and so I've got the option here to create a compiled help file and I've unticked the browser help output so close those both down. So now I've got two profiles, one's creating compiled help output and one's creating web help output. So I'm going to click the build button to kick off the build process. I'm going to build both at once. So I'll skip the video forward by 11 seconds just to skip the build process there. So we've got two outputs that have been produced. The first one is my compiled help file, familiar CHM file. And if you can see the title in the output is compiled help and the second output is my web output and we can see there that the title is web help in the output. So that's just a really simple example of how we can create a second build profile, how we can change a couple of the properties in that profile to create multiple outputs from the single project.